Yo, we got some new leaked items here. They seem to fit a certain theme, so does that mean that there's a certain event coming up? I don't know. We're also going to take a look at some new stuff in the catalog that is just fun and strange and weird, so stick around and check this out. What's up guys and welcome back to Dieter Play. So we've got some new leaks here on the RBX leaks page. I just want to let you guys know about the stuff that's coming out. Now it looks like we've got a theme going on here. We've got some dragon stuff. Except for this one thing. We've got a red durag. I don't know what a red durag is. is that like a durag is like a uh, it's like slang for dude rag, right? I think that's what it means. I don't know. So it's just something that you wrap around your hair. So this one is coming out fairly soon. I'm not sure what this one exactly means, but the rest of these that we've got, we got one, two, three, four, five, six items that all seem to be like dragon themed. And I was trying to think like the How Do You Train Your Dragon movie came out earlier this year. So I'm just kind of confused as to, you know, I don't think this is probably associated with that. If there's another movie, uh, you know, what if there is some sort of event? You would think that if there was some sort of event here going on that might be happening, that like the dragon themed event would be something or maybe they just made a bunch of dragon themed items here to make it uh i don't know consistent but these will probably either be on sale or part of an, uh, an event i don't really know for sure so this is speculation but it would really be cool if there was an event and sometimes when we have things that are along a certain theme that means that there's some sort of event that's coming as a part of it but we've got this dragon scale mohawk that looks really cool and this looks like it's going to go pretty well with some of these other dragon things that we've got here uh i know so like Terry Soros has a really cool dragon outfit one of the administrators uh, there's some really cool dragon stuff in the catalog already so some of the stuff will probably go with it really well we got a fancy dragon head um, okay fancy dragons didn't know dragons were fancy I thought that they were more you know kind of raw and but this one looks like it wears bowler hats uh, monocles and sips tea okay cool this one right here dragon hatchling on shoulders so this looks like it's going to be a shoulder item uh let's see this one's hair this one's probably a head face item this one obviously a shoulder item but that's so cute look at it little dragon hatchling that you get on your shoulder i can't wait for this one this one's this one's looking like it's gonna be pretty cute i might actually get that one because it looks kind of cool uh this one over here look at these wings chained chaos wings but they also look like dragon wings but a dragon that has been in chains. I feel sorry for this dragon. So far, these don't really seem to fit together. We got a blue shoulder dragon. We got like a red face. We got green wings. So it doesn't seem like they fit as a part of like one single Arthro bundle or anything like that. So it looks like they're just totally different individual items. They, they have a look and feel to me. To me, they have a look and feel of event things. So I don't know. But I would think if there's an event, it's got to be sponsored by something because they don't do it like normal events. And then they would just be free items that were sponsored and paid for by somebody. I don't know. Or they could be part of a promo code. Who really knows? Chances are they're probably going to be for Robux, though. We've got the Crimson Dragon Scale Shades here next. That's pretty cool. I don't know. Look a little bit cardboardy. A little bit freaky. These ones might be a little bit creepy when you see people wearing these ones. So I, I'll have to try those ones out when, whenever those are available. I don't know when these are going to be available on the catalog. Hopefully pretty soon, but they should be coming out. Sometimes they come out like a day after we know. They could come out today. They come out this weekend. They might not come out for a month. Who knows? And they might not come out at all. I don't know. Dragon Daring Dragon. Cobalt Daring Dragon Scarf. So this is a scarf. That's really weird. So I can imagine someone wearing all of these items. Uh, it would still look really weird, like overall. It would be this guy with like a little mohawk with with those scales, but then with a little little shoulder guy, and then these wings, and these <laughs> glasses, which would uh, probably mess with the, uh, the, the head, which would probably cover up the monocle, which is probably a good idea, because you don't really look like a genuine dragon when you look like that. But yeah, so it looks like there's something coming up here. Lots of dragon themed items hitting the catalog. So that'll be fun. Now we've got some other stuff that has hit the catalog just very recently here. We've got a page here of a lot of this stuff. Uh, black kitten head loaf. Weird, like why would a cat be a loaf? I don't know, it's weird. This top hat though, I love this top hat that was made here by Terabyte. This is great, so much color, really stands out, only 250 Robux, so I, that's a really cool one. These horns are looking really cool too, so shout out to Terabyte for doing some really cool stuff. Etheria keeping going with those antlers, these ones are the bubblegum antlers. Still look a little strange with the forward facing things, but it kind of be cool if there's like little uh, like strands of the bubbles. But if you guys play bubblegum simulator, these are probably a good theme thing. Of course, Beeism, Area 51 Alien today is 920, it's the day that they're supposed 
supposed to invade Area 51. I don't think it's really going to happen. Uh, unless, you know, maybe they've got a lot of government officials there at Area 51 ready for a big battle. And then nothing's going to happen. It'll be funny. But, of course, if you're going to invade, you need a UFO to get your aliens out of there. You, uh, let's see. we got some uh, dark enchantlers. Sweet. Beism just does some really amazing work with all of her, her UGC stuff. I, I'm just really impressed with the stuff that she creates. Her horns are great. The Riot Helmet. Now, that is something that we've needed in the catalog for a long time. So, Who to Trust created that one for us. Wolf Ears. We've got some Wolf Ears. We've got some headphones. Some of these that Who to Trust makes are kind of like basic like replications of real life items it seems like there's like real life items and they just look so real but that's kind of cool because these might mix a little bit better with arthro stuff so who to trust might be actually your arthro guy making packages and items that are going to go really well with all, all those arthro bundles so let's see i'm not sure what to do with the frappe we got some more ears over here now uh, there's this what there's one of these we're going to take a closer look at here this stare i really want to try that one up that one looks really weird. Area 51 Alien as a double from Beeism. That is awesome. Only 150 Robux. What's great is that they put the prices on these pretty reasonable. Not sure what's going on here with the ice cream tower. It's an ice cream cone with an ice cream cone and a, and a fudge bar on top of it. Splitting headache. Wow. So I guess um, somebody definitely, this is, you know, Jason. I don't know. This should have come out on the 13th, not September 19th. I'm just saying it should have come out on the 13th because it would have been great Friday the 13th because that's Jason never mind whatever anyways this one's stare I gotta try this one on this one's weird stare down your opponents and assert your dominance <laughs> this is oh whoa okay I gotta try this one on I just gotta see what it looks like on my face <laughs> oh my gosh look at this it's like a big head thing but it's like a minion oh my gosh this is crazy guys 300 robux for this one it is called the stair wow i don't know guys i might have to get this one just because it is so so creepy oh my gosh and my top hat it's funny because my top hat like the white band sort of seems to connect the eyeballs there in the front wow this is great what do you guys think is this a w or an l should i get the stair now dice soft this is, I think, his first entry in some of the creepy looking, like, uh, almost like instant classic sort of stuff. Like the sideways head, the bigger head. We've had some really cool stuff made by B Think, and Who to Trust has done some stuff like this too. But this one right here, this one, the stare, we got to give Dysoft a shout out on this one. This one's great. I might have to get this one. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. And of all of these new items, and all of the items that we have leaked here today, which ones do you think are the best looking items? Uh, I don't know, this Extreme Top Hat by Terabyte is really nice, the stare is fantastic. Of course, everything made by Beism, I think has the most amount of detail put into it. It's only 75 Robux here for the UFO hat, so that was just like perfect. So anyways, there's also these really cool dragon things. Anyways, uh, I try to keep you guys updated on any leaks and new things in the catalog. Anything as far as there's promo codes or free items in the catalog as well. I try to keep you updated. So make sure if you're new here, you subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And thank you so much for watching. We will talk to you guys later.